Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with another Siege of Paris video. And here I'm going to show you another place to farm XP in Francia. I am in southeast Paris. I started at this high point and then went along this road until I got to the intersection and then turned to reach this area where there are rebels and enemies fighting. And the reason this is a great place to farm XP or to get easy kills for the Ubisoft challenges that require you to kill 50 enemies is because after you kill these enemies, they will respawn, provided you just run a short distance from the area. I am using a double flail loadout here because this week's Ubisoft challenge is the Skull Crusher perform 50 kills using a flail. Now that I've killed all the enemies, I'm going to run back out to the intersection. You can run in any direction or you could fast travel from the area, although it takes longer to fast travel. It's usually much quicker to just run away and come back. And when I approach the area, you'll see all the enemies have respawned and I can kill them again. So these same enemies I just killed respawned. And so that is the glitch here. And you'll see I'm about to ignite my weapons. Now my flails are on fire and that's because I'm using the critical spark rune. I'll show you the weapons and runes I'm using here in a second, right after I kill the last of these enemies. And I see the rebels cheering, so that's how you know all the enemies are dead. So let's look at my inventory here. For my main hand, I've got Surtur's Mercy with the perk of increased fire damage when weapon is ignited. So I use the critical spark rune to ignite my weapon after critical hits. I bought this from Hildren's shop by completing the mastery challenges. And this one is spinning death in my offhand. And I'm gonna run over these bodies to loot them to pick up some silver and then run away and back again. Just to show you that the enemies do respawn. You'll notice that my first attack is gonna be an assassination because the enemies do not detect Eivor initially for some reason. But of course, if you're focusing exclusively on flail kills, you'd obviously want to let the enemies detect you first before slaying them to get the 50 flail kills as quickly as possible. Oh, and there I, I ignited my weapons again. Critical Spark is one of my favorite runes. The other of my two favorite runes is Curative Perfection. That's the other one I'm using here to heal me a little bit on critical hits. So that's why my health is always full even though I am taking a little bit of damage now and then. And then one more time, I'm going to leave the area and come back again to get my flail kills and also get in a few assassinations to get the XP. And also because I think the chain assassinations are just really fun. And here I'm going to attack the elite enemy first just to get him out of the way and chain assassination to get this other guard. And then go at it with my flails. If you've watched my other videos, you'll know that double daggers are actually my favorite combo, but I really also like double flails as well as double one-handed swords. So be sure to check out my other videos for more tips and tricks for Assassin's Creed Valhalla. This is Amber. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.